Hello, my friends. This is Jeannie. Welcome back. If you are a first time visitor, welcome. This is going to be a haul sheer video. I have a very big, large <laughs> haul um, from Tuesday morning that I want to share with you. As always, this is a cumulative haul because heaven forbid I should sit down and film things when I buy them. No, I let them sit around <laughs> until I find time. And by the time I find time, it becomes a cumulative haul because I would have made at least two visits to Tuesday morning by that point. And this is where we are at. This is a two visit <laughs> or two trip haul to Tuesday morning. Last weekend and also this weekend they had, um, this weekend they had, I definitely had to get there because they had the $10 off um, uh, your purchase of $40 or more. Um, so, um, that's an easy bar for me to meet. So definitely went and picked up some items. So I tried to kind of group these together. Sonic Studios has finally made it to my Tuesday morning. I have some of the Sheena dyes, tons of Bow Bunny, and tons of ephemera by Pebbles, as well as some paper. So I'm going to start this and I'm going to move at a faster than normal pace, my friends, because I'm going to try to get this all in one video. So let's start with Tonic Studios. I did pick up some of their dyes, not all of them. They had tons. They had this Merry Christmas dye, which FYI, in my Tuesday morning, they had this same dye uh, priced um, differently. One was a $3.99 price. The other one was a $9.99 price. Obviously, the $9.99 is a mistake because there's no way this itty bitty dye is going to be $9.99. Um, not when I found it. <laughs> Here it is for $3.99 in the same store. So if you see this dye at your Tuesday morning and you see a $9.99 price, definitely challenge that because that's not a correct pricing. Here is a larger one, also Merry Christmas, also Tonic Studios, $3.99 as well. That is the price on that one. Oh my gosh, these snowflakes are absolutely gorgeous. This one's called Falling Snowflakes Trio. So cute and so fun. Look at that. There's the information. So some of these dyes, I picked up duplicates because I wanted to save them for a challenge that I hope to launch soon. One that I've done before and I'm going to do again because the last time I did it, it was so much fun. That's the only clue I'm given. <laughs> so here is another Tonic Studio. This one is called Crawly Cobweb. So cute. Very Halloween, obviously, right? So it will go in my Halloween bin for next Halloween. So cute. Here are the, the um, Sheena Metal die sets that I told you about. These are um, by Sheena Douglas. This one here is called Voyage of Discovery. Really, really. So much fun. So many fun things you can do with this. Here's the information. I love this. That's going to be tons of fun to play with. Then there was this one in the pipeline. Fun. Here's the information. There's the back. That would be fun for some grungy or steampunk type um, projects. This one here is called Snowdrop Cluster. Of course, they put the price tag right over the photo, so you can't really see what it is, but it is to create this little cluster of flowers right there. That is the information. There is the die cut itself. Then they had some stamps. This one is by Crate Paper. Main Squeeze is what it's called. It is so cute. Valentine's Day. I can't even believe Valentine's Day is already um, finding its way into um, Tuesday morning. 
And what's crazy, uh, crazier is that there's some creators here on YouTube who are already putting up Valentine's Day project. Holy smokes. Can we just hit the brakes for a second? I'm still working on Christmas. <laughs> and you're already pushing on to Valentine's Day. So I will see you there because this girl is hanging back and going to enjoy Christmas before I get pushed off into the next holiday. This is a fun Christmas stamp. It is by Stampendous. It is um, striped peppermints. Really cute. How fun would this be for a background or to heat and boss onto a card? Very pretty. Here's the information. Then I found this really cute uh, memo pad. This is a magnetic notepad, 80 sheets, things. I must do today and I love the whole llama theme so that's what this is there's the information this was actually in the stationary section of my Tuesday morning I am learning or I've learned that crafty items are kind of being reorganized and resorted and put in different areas of the store it's not just a crafty section anymore some of the items are being pushed to the stationary section so i always make it a point to go there as well this is a six by six book um 20 vintage printed pages uh this was also this is by seven gypsies and it was in the um um stationary section this is called an architecture journal that's the information. Now, I moved that tag. It annoyed me. This tag was actually here, right? And then when I went to move it, it, of course, damaged the book. So I was a little annoyed, but I got over it. But geez, Louise, my gosh, you have this piece of paper right here. Put the tag on there. Don't ruin the book. <laughs> I wasn't going to return it. Um, so um, like I said, I got over it. That's what the inside looks like. Really fun book. Um, to do sketching or you can make it a cute little a journal or memory book of some kind um, this composition book is six by nine 60 pages and I've had this one before too here's the information there's the price and let me push this down so you can get the information also um, vintage inspired look at the pages on the inside so great for journaling or if you want to alter it for something else it's uh, like I said six by nine 60 pages great book and again it was in the composition I'm in mean, the stationary section of the store and the pages are heavy duty they're not cheap at all so good deal there found these cute little paper clips by Bella Boulevard also in the stationary section so here's the information on that. I think, no, they're different SKUs. Here is this color set, color combination set. And then here is this color combination set. Some brads. I love brads. <laughs> this one's called Happy Place. It's by Dear Lizzie. It's $2.19. So very pretty. This will be fun for spring projects. So very pretty. And then they had tons of paper house. So I picked up some of their dimensional stickers. This one is to die for. It is all ugly sweaters. I am going to make some cards right away using these for the Christmas holiday. So fun. So, so, so fun. If they had more than one, I would have grabbed it, but that's all they had. This one's called Crafty Like a Fox. Here's the information. Really cute. Fall, autumn. Very pretty. I'm not sure how I'm feeling about this glitter. I won't know until I take it out of the package what's going on there. <laughs> we all know how I feel about loose glitter. Um, but... $1.49. I thought I'd give it a try. Envelopes. Can't have enough of these. I go through these. It's amazing how many of these I use. These are by Jilly Bean. Um, it's Hampton Art. Uh, these are favor bags. You get... How many are you getting here? 12. For $1.19, these are white with gold polka dots or gold dots. 
I got two of these. So lately I have been making cards and using these um, envelopes or these bags as envelopes. So really fun and different. I got two of those. Here's a bigger one. This one is five by seven. It's good for an A2 size. Um, A2 sized cards, I believe. Uh, four and a half by five. Yeah, mm, maybe not. Yeah, no, they are. <laughs> I'm having a moment. Sorry, guys. I am tired, a little bit tired. Here's the information on this. So these you can emboss images onto. You can run them um, through your machine using an embossing folder. Or you can just stamp on them. It's just so easy, so fun. This is a snow and cocoa um, package or collection. Also by Crate Paper. This one uh, was a dollar ninety nine as well. Dollar ninety nine. You get eight bags, and these bags are already all treated. You get two of each of these styles right there. Right there. <laughs> Here are some more dimensional stickers. These are um, almost like tags, right? They're by Imaginis. Here's the information. I had a pack of these. I used it. So saw these. Picked up another one. Can always put them to use. Another set of these die cut bags. So far I have found Santa. I have found the reindeer. And now I found the snowman. So I've been getting a lot of use out of these bags as well. So didn't think twice about picking them up. So much fun to alter and play with. Okay, let's see. <laughs> Here is some Tim Holtz design tape. Um, this is the style for this particular one right there. And here is the information. This one's been in my Tuesday morning for a little bit and I kept passing on it and finally decided to pick it up. Here we have some more of these sequence, craft sequence tins. I got this one, very pastel. Very pretty. Love the pastel colors. That's the information on that one. This one's very um, more... Um, what do they call that? Traditional? No. Mm, I can't think of the word. But these are your reds, your blues, your whites, your yellows. Primary. Ha! That's the word I was looking for. A collection of sequins and more primary colors. Brights brights that's what they're calling them and not only do you have the sequence but you have other type of confetti in there as well i see um hearts i see stars and you have them in pretty much those all of those bright colors i did find some more a couple sets of beads that i picked up bead gallery these are gorgeous i love the blue here's the information on that Love the color. These, of course, sapphire beads. Beautiful. And these are assorted metal beads. I can't, for the life of me, right now, think of the name of what these are. I know what they are. In my mind, I know what they are. But I can't remember <laughs> the name right now. I'm just having a moment. Drawing a blank. But saw these. Absolutely had to have them for $1.99. Why not? And then, <laughs> I know I'm moving so fast, guys. I really, I'm, I want it in one video. Let's move on to, you know what? Let me show you the ephemera, the pebbles ephemera that I found. Um, this, These are printed cardstock shapes. This one is called Cozy and Brights. And this is what comes in this particular collection. And I believe I got, did I get two of those? I did. I got two of those. So that's that. And then <laughs> these are cute. These are um, also by Pebbles mini envelopes. Oh my gosh, look at that. These are 12 mini envelopes and that's what you get. So I thought these would be fun for journaling, junk journals. Um, art journals or just 
um, envelope style projects. Those are really tiny. I'm liking those a lot. Now I think I'm pretty, yeah, I'm pretty caught up with all the other stuff. Let me show you all of the Bow Bunny. We're going to move super quick here, guys. I found this set of 96 journaling cards. Really pretty. Look at these journaling cards. And of course, you know, they covered again. They covered. Mm. Oh, I should have taken off beforehand so that you can see. And of course, I can't now. But you get 60 pieces that are 2x2 two two in size, 20 that are 3x3, three and, three, and 16 that are 4x4. Four four. So really pretty. Here are some of the patterns that you will receive. How awesome is that? We have some of the noteworthy and layered chipboard ephemera, also by Bow Bunny. Let me just bring this out a little bit here. Here is one. This one is called Paradise. These are large, 32 pieces. That's what you get. Okay, there's the information. These are huge. Here's another one, Easter. I love this one. It's Easter themed. It's called Cottontail. There you go. Isn't that great? That's what you get. So I got two of those. Here is the layered chipboard. This is beautiful. This one is called Early Bird. Isn't that gorgeous? Look at this clock. Beautiful. Time for tea. It's the information. Fun, fun, fun. And then I have more Bow Bunny. More Bow Bunny. <laughs> More of the layered chipboard. This one is uh, Yuletide. Is that gorgeous? Here's the information. This one is called also Yuletide. Did I get? No, it's a different one. Yuletide Carol. The other one was called. Uh, Christmas in the Village. Hmm. This one's called Yuletide Carol. Really pretty. Look at that Santa. So fun. I was very lucky. I found, I got two of those. I got quite a few things there. They had so, so much. I got a lot. I got a lot. Bow Bunny laser cut chipboards. I got the butterflies. There's the information. You get three styles of butterflies, two of each. So these are fun to use in your mixed media projects or to make cards or ATCs. Um, you just put a layer of gesso on them and then you can pretty much color them in whatever color you want. This one here is called lace tags. You get four tags. Pretty. And then I have... Um, I don't know if I show. No, I didn't. This is another Bull Bunny layered chipboard. This one is called Cottontail. This one, I might have shown you this one already. I don't know. I feel like I just did. Hmm. Braxton, just wait, buddy. Just wait. Okay. And then finally, yes, we are up to the stamps. I found so many um, Bow Bunny stamps. This one is called Santa and Friends. Oh boy, as much as I'm trying to get this all in one video, I'm just realizing I have the paper pads. The paper pads are going to be a separate video, so there we are. This is going to be a two-parter. So let me at least show you the stamps. I got two of those, and I'm going to put one in a giveaway um, to be announced at a later date. This one is called Painted Circles. There's that information. This one here... It's called Floral. Adventures Icon is this one. Here 
here's the information. This one is called Circular Textures. This would be fun to make flowers. Mm-hmm. You can create some beautiful backgrounds with that one. This one is called Doodle Blooms. Another fun one. Goodness gracious. Those are so fun. I got two of those because I'm going to be putting one in the giveaway. This one is called Recipe Card. Look at that. So fun. Geometric Patterns is this one. And then we have Say Cheese. So we have hit the 20 minute mark on this video, my friends. So I am going to stop here on this one. I will do a part two. That one's going to be super short. And that one I will show you the Bow Bunny paper pads that I picked up. I picked up two, four, six, seven of them. <laughs> <laughs> and a couple of kits that I also found at my Tuesday morning. So lucky, lucky me. I found so, so much. So thank you for hanging with me all this time. Hopefully I moved at a reasonable clip. I didn't go too fast. Um, if you need those cues, just pause the video, write them down. The 1-800 number is going to be in the information bar down below. So thank you so much. I truly do appreciate it. And I hope you visit me again. Until next time, my friends. Bye-bye.